Our series, The Tech Effect, it's only been a few months since we started hearing about ChatGPT, and the AI chatbot is already finding its way into classrooms. Becca Jarvis is back, and we're seeing teachers incorporate this technology into their lesson plans. George, this technology is still so new. It comes with plenty of unknowns, and it raises some very big questions about plagiarism and cheating, which is why some schools have actually banned it, but other schools are now incorporating ChatGPT into their lesson plans, and we got an up-close look at how. These fifth grade students might look like they're doing an average writing assignment. Ooh, what do you think? But their prompt wasn't created by their teacher. Instead, they chose from 10 different options generated in seconds by ChatGPT, an artificially intelligent chatbot. Like every other educator, I had that concern. Is this something that students are only going to use to cheat? So I started to think about like, okay, what role is AI, artificial intelligence, going to play in the classroom? Kentucky Teacher of the Year Donnie Piercy let us peek inside his Lexington fifth grade class where they utilize ChatGPT in a number of ways. From grammar exercises like Find the Bot, where students have to guess which paragraph was written by ChatGPT versus their classmates. Do these jump out as like, ooh, I'm pretty sure it's not that one? For the second one, because uh -huh. they put invention plethora of inventions, they should have put a plethora. Oh, but they made a, interesting they made a catch. Mistake. And also they they made a mistake. Mistake. To reading exercises through personalized plays generated in seconds by the program. <laughs> a typical fifth grade classroom, the door bursts open. And a superhero named Super Potato bursts in. Fear Rock Simpson, Super Potato is here to save the day. So the big thing that I've looked for as a teacher over the last 17 years is what things can I bring into my lessons that inspires my students to be creative. With AI, with ChatGPT, I've always looked for a way that I can use this tool to inspire my students to become better students to really master content. Many of his students think of it as something that's here to stay. So if it keeps on expanding, that's basically typical for what this generation is doing right now. I feel like it could evolve a lot over time. If you keep AI, like, safe, going to be really helpful. And it's not just elementary school. Across the country in Oregon, mother and son teachers Tobin and Cherry Shields utilize it at the high school and collegiate level. It's going to make our educational system more accurate, and it's going to make it more interesting and more accessible and more creative, where I think a lot of educators think it's going to do the opposite. Sherry, an educator of 30 years, penning an opinion piece for Education Week titled, Don't Ban ChatGPT. Use it as a teaching tool. I do think employers in the future are going to be asking employees to work with AI. It's just a, a life skill that we are going to have to perpetuate forward if we want our students to be viable in the workplace. Some very interesting applications there, but of course there are those very real concerns about cheating, plagiarism, authenticity. OpenAI, the company that created ChatGPT, has also created what they call an AI classifier. That is a program that can essentially decipher whether text was written by AI or by a human. Many other companies are working on similar programs. George, I predict this piece is gonna be in a time capsule 30 years from now, those, those fifth graders talking right. about the future. We're going to look at the world so differently. Yeah, but because you don't of this want technology. kids to lose the ability to write. Exactly, and have creativity and come from themselves, not yeah. from the machine. Right. Rebecca, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here, to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.